Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Word. In this module, I want to show you how you can do a mail merge with images. So what I'm going to do is connect this Word document to an Access database which has photographs in it. And then I'm going to do a mail merge so you can see how it, how it would work. So first of all, let's go to Mailings and select recipients. So I'm going to use an existing list, like I said, an access database. So I just need to find that. So it's in examples, access 2018, and it's this relationship demo database. So if I open that, and it's a consultant's table that I want. So that's linking that together. But if I just see if I can open that database, I should have probably opened it first. Going to open up as locked, but never mind. In that database, we have some personal records with photographs. So if I just come back down into it, so on this form, these are the photographs that I'm going to do a mail merge on. Just close that down. And for it to work in Access, you have to have the path of where that photograph is. That's the path where it is. All those photographs. That's how that's working. So when I close this down, you know, back to Word. So if I go into there, we've got the information there. There's all the people. So what I want to do is individually insert a merge field. So first name surname that's all I want and then just come down a bit and insert the photo field now what we have to do is put some merge fields here to get this to work because if I merge it at it as it is at the minute if I go finish and merge let's just have a look okay you just get the path coming through which is obviously not what I want I want the actual photograph coming through so if I close that down Let's see what we have to do. So first thing you have to do is select this and then do Control and F9, which will put those squiggly brackets on. And then what you're going to put in front of picture is Merge Field. That's the first thing you've got to do. Then the second thing you've got to do is highlight the whole thing again and do Control F9 to get another set of brackets. So now what you're going to do is you're going to put if true in front of that. So that's that's okay. And then highlight the whole thing again. Do control F9 for a third time. And then what you're going to put now is include picture in front of all of that. And then on the last set of brackets on the right, you're doing a backward slash and a D. Now, let's see what happens when we do the finish and merge this time. Okay. Now, it comes up with this little box. Um, you have to select the field from here. So, come back down to photo. That's the path. Okay. And there you go. There's the photo on each page. So you can do this for QR codes, seen lots of examples where QR codes have been stored in databases and you want them to be showing the actual QR code on the end product. But this is just doing it with a photograph and as long as the path is correct, the photograph will come through. So that's a very quick look at how to do a mail merge with images. So hopefully you found that useful. Thank you for your time and I'll see you on the next one.